and self-improvement will become more affordable. Like you will, you will think that only making it more affordable is the main thing. But also the, the thing that I'm most about, right? I don't, I don't really care about 68 cents on the fucking milk. If the milk from the superstore was better than the milk from the farmer, which is which obviously it is not, then I would obviously get it from the fucking superstore. I would get it where it's the best and just pay the 68 cents, whatever. But if I can get something cheaper and better, I'm gonna get it there. Like, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care if there is no label on the bottle or something. As long as it's not a fucking plastic birth control <laughs> fucking bottle with fucking, well, what's that shit called? BPA on there, or fucking chemicals that the bottle is made of. As long as it's not that, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that, right? At, at the fucking superstore, it gets scanned and shit and fucking, fucking microplastic gets onto it and fucking receipts the, the fucking cashier often just puts the receipt on your stuff and on the fucking coverings on the of the fucking bottle and now you can't drink off of, out of it before like fucking micro cleaning the fucking thing with a towel or something else. like it's a horrible nightmare shopping in a in a, in a superstore where they're like all so stressed and the energy is so bad and the fucking the frequency in there is also like messed up if you're sensitive to frequency like if, if you can switch this frequency mode on and if you can see people's faces and they're all looking so fucking negative and distressed you cannot fucking see this at some at some farmer's market where you're getting it from the farmer and it doesn't have to be more expensive this doesn't mean that you have to go to a farmer's market you can go to some farmer in your local area, if you're not living in the city, of course, city boys are kind of fucked, you already have to drive out to the land. You can just drive out to a farmer <laughs> and ask him if he can sell you some fucking meat or some eggs or some milk and you and you will have your shit covered for like five bucks because they're used to selling their shit to a fucking wholesale. And there, they get like fucking 36 cents for their stuff, right? They get 36 cents per liter from the wholesale channel. And from you, they get a dollar. That's like three times more. <laughs> and they will think, oh, this is crazy. This is a good business opportunity here. Yeah? yeah. And therefore you improve their lives. So it's a win, win, win. It's a win for you because you pay less money. It's a win for you because you get better quality food. And it's also a win for the buyer, for the seller because he can make some more money from you than the wholesale usually pays them. So I guess the message of this video would be just get something from where it's made, not from where it's sold. So go to the farmer, go to the, go to the fucking retailer if you want to pay much for a bad product. And if you want the shopping experience of, oh, over there is a crying mom with his crying baby. Over there is a chain smoker. Over there is a guy who will never have sex in his life again. And the cashier is depressive. If you want that experience, fine, cool. <laughs> Pay your margins, but I'm gonna go to the farmer, get my milk there, keep my testosterone, and fucking be pumped for the next workout session by that. If you're trying to be like extra autistic about self-improvement, do that. I promise you will never feel better. You will never feel better than walking away from the farmer, seeing the cows that literally made your milk. It tastes better, it feels better, and it also is cheaper. Master your mind.